So with Sony now confirming that yes, Spider-Man is 100% out of the MCU with standalone and team of films, they have revealed in that Variety article exactly what's happening next. He is joining the Venomverse. So I don't think anybody's going to argue with you that Venom was a huge success. It doesn't matter what the critics thought, you just look at the box office and it's a good indicator that success was obviously there. So to me it came as no surprise when I said it last October that they were going to pull Spidey from the MCU and focus on their own universe. Now we know that this is in fact happening considering Sony came out there and they're like look, yeah the door's closed. Um. We're done. Spider-Man for now is done with the MCU. We have our own thing we're doing. And when they said that, the next line when talking about the future of Spider-Man was talking about the fact that they're bringing back the shared universe. Now, of course, this isn't anything new. They tried to do one with the amazing Spider-Man, but it didn't really take off and they had to kind of scrap everything and go back to the drawing board, hence the MCU deal. But now they're very confident again, and they did say that Spider-Man's future lies within a shared universe connected to the current ongoing films, meaning that we will be seeing Spider-Man toe-to-toe, face-to-face with the upcoming Venom universe, and of course Morbius and everything else they're developing, thus the Venomverse is officially getting Spider-Man. I mean, again, it's no surprise here, you just have to look at the pattern, and to them, realistically, you know, I can see why they're doing this. You know, Disney wanted to share the profits, they didn't want to budge, Disney didn't want to budge, Sony didn't want to budge, so ultimately, Sony's left with their own properties. What do they do? Well, the only thing they can do is instead of rebooting everything completely is toss Spider-Man into Venom and hopefully people accept it and hopefully that universe can become the second rival to the MCU. Who knows how that's going to unfold because again, look at Venom, right? Like, I don't know what to say. You know, that movie did huge for box office so certainly there's something there that people want adding Spider-Man to it, you're guaranteeing more money, so it's just a no-brainer, and I'm not going to sit here and defend Disney, because, again, they were in the wrong as well, everybody was in the wrong with this one, but ultimately, this is happening, they now confirmed it, how fast though, anybody's guess, but hey, look, they already confirmed he's coming to that shared universe, so, things could be fast-tracked.